7.40 in the morning. There's people eating at Outback. <laughs> oh, never mind. They have a breakfast menu. For people who can't wait for Best Buy to open. <laughs> Tupelo. Tupelo at nighttime. Tupelo yellow light. Johnny's. This is an old school restaurant. Elvis used to eat here a lot. Oh, that's neat. Oh, yeah, you told me. Yeah. Are you, are you, why are you filming? Selfie inside so uh, everyone can see what it looks like. Dough burgers. Of the first four episodes. So you gotta give me the rest of them on the thumb drive. You saw it on your, on your own. Right now, the bus gets to the, gets to the border and it still reeks. Guestbook. It was a little while ago, actually, um, but there was a time where I was. Yeah. Milkshake. Thank you. Oh, score. Dough burger. Put <laughs> picture in it. Okay, cool. Okay, one, two, three. Hey, guys. I'm going to be leaving my room. In the south. Whoa, whoa, where's it going to be? Right here at the left. So we're going to find the first... I can pull over... The very first paved road in the south. I guess to stop first. Derps. Stop. Alright, so I'm going to pull up on this little All right. gravel. Ooh. So... Now there was that, a... That road? Yeah, this is the road right here. Oh, this is it. Yeah, this is old 45. Yeah. And if you follow, look at an old map. Now, they originally dedicated in 1990 because they had a brass plaque on the other end of the road. Somebody stole it. Oh my gosh. Sold it for scrap. Yeah. They rededicated this in 2008. So what it <laughs> is, there's asphalt here on either side of that concrete. The concrete used to go all the way over the end. Yeah. Concrete center went all the way to the end. On either side of the concrete, there was gravel. Yeah. Just like that. There's so many wrecks. Really? Most people would drive too fast around the curves. They'd lose control in the gravel, or they would be driving on the concrete to avoid the gravel. So, no, bicyclists. <sighs> on one of the oldest paved roads. See? Very cool. Um. <clears throat> so open here. Now this is not, this is uh, owned by the DC family. I think I keep it still. Now this up here is Mount Vernon Road. Uh-huh. Uh, so, you take a right and you end up at dead ends. Butt Street going across the road. Okay, that's a challenge. It's, they, they it's supposed to be a challenge. They challenge. might want to, yeah, a challenge. They might want to. It's supposed to be a 69 Charger. <laughs> Put a mirror under his nose, make sure. Uh, I was at like uh, band night at the. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I went to California to, to try it out. It's pretty good. I love this place. This old, oh, old. Yeah. What was the deal with the Clydesdales? Why Old's awesome. awesome. Is it? That crazy old mama mine. Yeah. Elvis got his first guitar here. I'm gonna check out this place called Abner's. Looks kind of local, so I want to eat it. Why are the gators here? the Mississippi River. <laughs> oh, it's warm. Hey guys, so this is my last night here in Tupelo and I, I love coming here. This is my third year coming to Tupelo and I got to see a lot more than I did last year. I mean, I saw a lot last year, but I saw more of Tupelo 
itself. So, you know, I went to the battlefield of Bryce's Crossroads. Next time I come, I definitely want to check out the battlefield in Corinth, uh, which is like an hour from here, but I want to check that out and then do another uh, tour video, you know, where I just film myself touring around the battlefield. Um, but yeah, I, I ate at all these uh, different restaurants here in Tupelo. This time I avoided places that I could get back in Orlando, you know, like Papa John's, Olive Garden, Chili's. I avoided that this time. This time I went for local stuff. So I went to Abner's, which is, uh, its specialty is our heavy, uh, we, you know, chicken, chicken tenders. So you can get them either grilled or fried. I got mine mixed, two, two fried, two grilled, really good. The French fries are awesome. Um, I also went to Romy's where I got catfish and I went to uh, Vanelli's Pizza which was in downtown Tupelo. I think the owner was Greek American because he put a lot of like jokes about um, about his heritage. Like, you know, like playful jokes. It wasn't making fun of it. Um, I also went to uh, the, the, the Rib Shack which is near the hotel here. Um, out of all the places I went to for food, I, I can't say which one was my favorite but my favorite french fries were from Abner's. Their fries were awesome. The, the French fries were, were really crispy and tasted really good. I didn't need to put ketchup on them. Um, I liked the ribs a lot. I did like the catfish a lot too. I, I basically liked all the food I went to this time. Um, but yeah, uh, I, I made two videos while I was in Tupelo. That's why I came here. One video was for the uh, Tupelo Con 2018. Actually, that was the reason why I came here. I went here for that video. And then as a side video, I made a video for the uh, Bryce's Crossroads uh, Civil War Battlefield. Um, now these videos will be on my other channel, so if you want to see those, I can put the link in the, in the description. And all the clips that I put in this video, they were just random clips that I took while I was eating or just walking around. I just took random clips. I decided, hey, why not make a video out of it? So you can see some of my random stuff in Tupelo. But yeah, it's my last day here in uh, Tupelo, my last night. Hopefully I come back next year. Hopefully they invite me back. But I want to enjoy this pool before they close. They close at 10. It's like 9.30 now, I think. So, thanks for watching this video, guys. I, I love being back in the South. As you know, I'm from Florida, but Florida doesn't seem like the South. Like, geographically, it's in the South, but culturally, it seems a lot different. And, you know, I grew up in Louisiana, so I do know Southern culture. I don't sound like I do, but I, I don't have the accent, but that's where I grew up in the South. All right, guys, see you later.